Hi guys, so before I start the video, I wanted to talk for a minute because this video was originally supposed to go up last Tuesday and I decided not to upload it after everything happened regarding the Black Lives Matter movement and the murder of George Floyd. I thought it was more important for me to focus on amplifying Black voices rather than just posting a very lighthearted, like kind of meaningless in the grand scheme of everything that's going on type of video. So in the description, I'm gonna be including a list of resources, including petitions, places to donate, please, Please, even though I'm posting a normal video, and even though a lot of YouTubers are gonna be going back to posting normal content now, Black Lives Matter is not a trend. It's not like a one week sort of thing. It's still so important to be speaking out against police brutality, to be signing petitions, donate, but yeah. Hi, welcome back. Today I'm doing something I saw a few people do and I thought it was a really cool idea because obviously I haven't been able to thrift, but my dad recently gave me two pairs of his old Levi's that I cut into shorts and I wanted to thrift more of his other clothes, but he didn't have any, unfortunately. So what I'm doing instead is I'm gonna be styling outfits using my dad's clothes, but at the end, give them back. And I'm not like DIYing them or anything. So I have to take his clothes in their current form. Not that they're in bad, Form, but you know, I have some really cool ideas and actually I think these might be cooler outfits that I normally wear because like current fit, t-shirt, leggings, like it's so weird. I feel like I know a lot about fashion, but it doesn't always translate <laughs> to my actual outfits. Anyway, hopefully you guys like it. Let's start. So I wanted to start by comparing our styles. So my dad's style, I feel like could be classified as suburban dad with an emphasis on blue. All of his clothes are blue. I don't know why, but they are. <laughs> then for my style, this is my Pinterest board. That's definitely more of my goal style, but either way, it's completely different. So this is definitely gonna be kind of hard. I do like blue, but not really in the same way. <laughs> Okay, I'm trying to find options, I think. So I definitely want a sweatshirt. I mean, plain blue is always very safe. Gray, I don't really like gray. All right, I think I'll go for the blue. And then as a second option, Detroit Lions, I need a, oh, like a t-shirt. I think this could maybe be cool. Yeah, for sure with that. Oh, he did have a sweater. I like that. Then I need a white button down. This one. Let's go. This is kind of what inspired this video. I had this idea. So what I want to do is take a white button down and put it underneath a sweatshirt. I have this button down, basic, and the collar is very thick, I guess, like structured. So I think that would be really good. Very basic, Land's End, such a dad brand. <laughs> and I have Detroit Lions. Literally, where am I? I'm drowning. All right. I think it looks cool. I'm not sure. I feel like I look British a little bit. I think the collar is kind of stiff, but like kind of still cool. This is so comfy and I kind of like it. I like the black a lot more. So I want to try wearing it with a skirt. I have a black skirt. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I want to see if this will look good with a skirt. It might not, but it might. We don't know. I mean, okay, with the plaid, I do think it's kind of pajama. So I'm going to try the skirt. I think that'll be a big upgrade. It's a little school uniformy, but kind of in a cute way, I feel like. I never had a school uniform, so I think they're cute, but like, I get it. Maybe if I'd had one, I'd be like, should this be untucked? I want to add shoes. I saw this picture on Instagram and I want to try to recreate it. Here are my clothes, then. I am not sure. Okay, wait, maybe if I get a bag. She has like a little bag. Here we go. This is cool. Something I've seen a lot is, well, not a lot. Something I've seen is people wearing a shirt like this as a dress. And this one, honestly, it's fingertip length. I could have worn this to high school. I just, 
How do I, maybe if I like wrap it a little bit, I don't want it to be too risky business, you know? But I'll see. Oh, let me look it up. Oh my God, I'm obsessed with myself. It says search for 21st birthday gifts. In my defense, I was just looking up 21st birthday because I feel like on social media, I don't know, I like never see people my own age. I just wanted to find some older people. So I was looking up 21. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna look up button down shirts. Wait. I need to look at button down shirt. Okay, this is kind of what I want to do. So button it, and then I have a chain belt kind of like that. Okay, I could either do this or I think the silver one. All right, obviously the pants should go. <laughs> All right, now the big moment. I feel like I want it to be pretty tight. Cinch. Oh, I can't breathe. Breathing's overrated. It is a little short. Put on denim shorts. Okay, I don't know why, but for some reason it reminds me of a bathrobe a little bit. You know like those ones you get from a hotel? But then also, it's kind of cool. Let me know what you guys think. I mean, it kind of worked. I mean, this is very casual. What's cool about this one is that none of it is my own clothes. So the top is my dad's, and then the shorts are his old Levi's jeans that I cut in my thrift flip. These jeans were so muddy and gross looking, and they ended up looking really good as shorts, so kind of proud of myself to be honest. Definitely like it. I do want to try with the plaid pants. I'm gonna see if these spice it up at all. I shouldn't have worn the shorts under. I approve. Next, I have a sweater. I really like this. Honestly, I would wear this. It's L.L. Bean, medium tall, so it's gonna be really long. Okay, I'm gonna try that with these pants. I know these pants are like coming into a mall, but they go really well with all my men's clothes, clearly. All right, look at how long. Can you see that? This could be a dress. This is like a sweater dress. Anyway, let me tuck it in, because like, oh my gosh, it's so much fabric though. I want this sweater, basically. Can you see that? It's so thick. I'm literally sweating because I have the studio lights on. It looks good. Never thought I'd say that about my dad's clothes. My style, I guess, is suburban dad. Okay, what else could I do with this? I'm literally improvising. Let me see with the Levi's. I'm really layering out here. Okay, there's so much fabric. I don't even know what to do. Maybe, what if I have this? Coupons, we going on well. And you know I got them refilled. Love this. To be completely honest, kind of shocking. All right, I keep seeing people wearing sweatshorts and I think they're cool, but like, would they look good on me? It's kind of like biker shorts. Like those scare me. I've never worn them before. They might be really big on me. <laughs> Basketball coach, middle school PE teacher. <sighs> what do I even do? Okay, maybe a roll? They're so long, they're like not in the camera. It's just not a good sign. Okay, wait, kind of a good idea. This might be controversial. Low key, kind of cute. See, I don't know, is the top too nice for these like pajama shorts? I mean, I do have like a blue Nike top. Wait, let me just tuck that. Not bad. Wait, I like this. I don't know, comment down below. Is this really ugly? Don't say it like that. Say that wasn't my favorite look. Tell me why I completely forgot about the navy blue pocket tee. Like, why was I using my own t-shirt when there was one right there? Oh, wait. I'll take it. Like, what? <laughs> My dad has had this leather jacket since I was literally a newborn. Not even kidding. But it does look very different now. I'm wearing this black tank top with my plaid pants again. <sighs> I think I need black pants maybe. The one problem about that, all my black pants are at college. Wait, I have no idea if these fit. These are like really gross skinny jeans from Fashion Nova in like 2015. But they're supposed to be like butt lifting, but I love you. I don't remember if they actually do that. I kind of remember them being a little bit ugly, but they're what I have. This one gets kind of an okay. I'm not sure. Something's a little off. Like, I feel like it looks kind of frumpy. Like, I don't know though. It's hard to match because it's not black. So I'm not really sure what color I would wear. Like, I like the black under it, but the jeans, it's just like kind of boring, I guess. And it's so big. I don't know. It's very comfy though. It's very warm. So I approve. I get why he kept it for 21 years. Let me know how would you style this? Because I feel like I could do better. Like, 
I don't know, I have high expectations for myself and I really don't know what else to do. I'm really tired now, but those are my outfits. If you like the video, be sure to give it a like, subscribe, obviously, and follow me on Instagram. I've been trying to post a lot more and you can follow me on TikTok. I finally had a viral TikTok. Go check it out. As always, have a great day. I hope you're doing great and I will see you on... What day is it? I'm not sure if I'm posting this Tuesday or Friday. I'll see you either next Tuesday or next Friday at 12 p.m. Eastern time. Bye.